Don't be a dick, bro. I'm trying to look out for you. Just give me the key. Whatever. Just Dad. Like, stay away. Totally from fine. Me, okay? Just had a couple of beers. What are you talking about? We had like six shots each. Look at you. Will you two just make out already? Hey, can you give me a ride? Just so Boy Scout there can get his buzzkill badge. There's my car. Where are we going? I'm on Alta Place. Off, uh, Howick Ave. It's not that far. Oh, I don't feel so good. <sighs> I just got a mouthful of, of something. You better take it slow. Hey, thanks for this, man. As you can see, I could have driven. No problem, but Joy Killer back there had to lay a guilt trip on me. Hey, you better wait! Shit. Wasted or something? Oh shit. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna bark. Oh, that's it, little man. Sing me a rainbow. <laughs> Dude, sorry about that. Uh, most of it went out the window. I'll, uh, I'll throw some cash your way. I promise you're not as interesting as you think you are. Well, yeah, I feel much better. That tactical vomit really sorted me out. I'm starving now. Oh, yes! I still got some clock and bell at home from last night. I am all over that! I tell you, the planets are aligned, bro. Karma is sucking my boy right now. Now, try that again without slurring. Thanks for the ride, man. Sorry for blowing chunks. Take this toward the cleaning. I'll see you around. Try not to pass out and choke on your sick.
wonderful. A veritable treasure trove. Just ignore us. Yes, don't mind us. Pretend we're not here. Okay. You're not Jock Cranley, are you? Actor and artist? I love your work. Oh, stunt double. Oh, our favorite show. Mrs. Thornhill, snap. Watch the birdie. Oh, we pretend to throttle me. <laughs> yes, yes, like you did on that, on that poster you did. Yeah, okay, all that would be my pleasure. <laughs> oh. uh, like that, huh? Yeah. Oh. Uh, uh, maybe something oh. like this. Or oh. like that, huh? You like that? That's enough, huh? now, dear. You like that? Oh. 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 oh, hey. Oh. Oh. Thank mm. you. Wow, that's quite a woman oh. there, huh? Oh. We are not worthy. We're, We're not, not worthy. worthy. We're, We're not I'm, worthy. Uh, I'm not Jock, uh... What's his name? Cranley. Big star in the 80s. We well, love celebs. Oh. That's why we came to Tinseltown. Yes. Before we met you, we were trying to break in to Bruce Spade's house and steal his rubbish. The things these stars throw away. Oh. They're not like you or me. <laughs> Mrs. Thornhill has the most unbelievable collection of celebrity underwear and bathroom products, things they've actually used themselves. You guys have a great vacation, all right? I gotta go. We could do with some help. All this climbing over walls and rooting through bins, it's such a business. Nigel's got an arthritic knee. Yeah. What do you, uh, what do you need? Just a few Vinewood souvenirs for my mm museum. Look, 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 look at this map. I mean, a lot of these places have famous people living in them, and some that are just hanging about. Bring us some things. I'd be very thankful indeed. Americans are the most wonderful people in the world, aren't they? The best! <laughs> <laughs> Such fun! <laughs> <laughs>
to this thing!
Trot and shits with more brains. Guess it's coyote for dinner.
There you are, Trevor. Ah, oh, if it ain't my favorite marksman, huh? How are you, Cletus? Fine and dandy, sir. You ready to hunt some elk? Ah, uh, beat satellite dishes. <laughs> Lead the way. Oh, here you go. Now, uh, put this in your mouth. A bad day hunting still beats a good day working, my pa always used to say. What is this thing in my mouth? And why do I have the feeling I'm not the first person to use it? Out. Explain that in a while. Let's start with the basics for now. Elk senses are razor sharp. If they see you or hear you, you'll spook them. And they'll bolt. You gotta move slowly and quietly and keep that aside. But an elk's nose is as big as defense. When you're tracking elk, you always need to watch the wind direction. If you don't stay downwind of them, they'll pick up your scent and be gone before you can say boo. Especially with that distinctive, uh, musk of yours. I'm calling pot and kettle on that, my friend. All right, this is a prime area right here. You feeling ready, Trevor? Raring to go. Okay, let's see if we can bag ourselves some elk. I saw a young bull using the down tree to scratch his antlers on not ten minutes ago. Follow me. I'll keep us downwind so we don't spook him. Just remember what I told you. This is a prime area right here. You feeling ready, Trevor? Raring to go. Okay, let's see if we can bag ourselves some elk. I saw a young bull using the down tree to scratch his antlers on not ten minutes ago. Follow me. I'll keep us downwind so we don't spook him. Don't get your panties in a wad now. Three speeds. On, off, and don't push your luck. Go on, put them down. Get a heart as clean as you get. Very nice. Get up here, quick! Stay close. All right, stick with me. I'll lead us further in. Keep quiet and stay close. I ain't seen much else or nothing else out here. But we're gonna have to see if we can coax one into the open. That's where that thing you've been chewing on comes in. Ah, yes. Please enlighten me. It tastes like old person.
that's a diaphragm. Mm-hmm. An elk whistle for you and me. All right, give it a good blow. See if we can get any nearby elk to holler back. Sounds like someone strangling a clarinet player, and I talk from experience. Shh, listen. Okay, you hear that? He's over there. You're downwind, so he's yours to lose, Trevor. Go get him. Park yourself there if I was you. You got him. Hold on. In the neck, not too bad at all. Okay, follow me. We'll move a little further in. Stay quiet. I think we might have a mating pair up ahead. Let's check it out. Now, remember, if it's a pair, we're only here for the male. No does. That's my rule. So if you see one with no antlers, leave it be. Blow your whistle again. See if you can get a beat on them. Okay, this is good. Same as before, nice and steady. Give another honk on that diaphragm. We'll move a little further in. Stay quiet. I think we might have a mating pair up ahead. Let's check it out. Now, remember, if it's a pair, we're only here for the male. No does. That's my rule. So if you see one with no antlers, leave it be. Blow your whistle again. See if you can get a beat on them. Okay, this is good. Same as before, nice and steady. Give him another call. Not the flatheads. Me. We'll move a little further in. Stay quiet. I think we might have a mating pair up ahead. Let's check it out. Now, remember, if it's a pair, we're only here for the male. No does. That's my rule. So if you see one with no antlers, leave it be. Blow your whistle again. See if you can get a beat on them. Okay, this is good. Same as before. Nice and steady. Now, let's, you got this now, Trevor. Uh, you're on your own for the next one.
Tell you what, I got an idea how we can go in on this together. Text me, pick your next kill, and we'll talk business. Ah, I gotta go. Uh, good luck. I'll holler at you in a while. this now, Trevor. Uh, you're on your own for the next one. Tell you what, I got an idea how we can go in on this together. Text me, pick your next kill, and we'll talk business. Ah, I gotta go. Uh, good luck. I'll holler at you in a while. this now, Trevor. Uh, you're on your own for the next one. Tell you what, I got an idea how we can go in on this together. Text me, pick your next kill, and we'll talk business. Ah, I gotta go. Uh, good luck. this now, Trevor. Uh, you're on your own for the next one. Tell you what, I got an idea how we can go in on this together. Text me, pick your next kill, and we'll talk business. Ah, I gotta go. Uh, good luck. I'll holler at you in a while.
Got the photo. Another nice kill. So this is what I'm thinking. All this demand for wild raised meat with them city folks right now? If we divide and conquer, I reckon we could make ourselves a tidy little sideline. Text me a photo of your quarry. I'll let you know what it's worth and come by to pick it up as soon as I can. I like my meat with some age on it anyways. Uh, what do you say? Yeah, I say we'll see. I got a few other irons in the fire at the moment. All right, well, the offer's there. And you can keep that elk collar. Was my grandma's before she passed. Uh, be hearing from you. a bad way. Don't even go there. Stop that right now or I will report you. Don't even go there. I am calling the police. Hello, can you send an officer here right away? Make me cry. Come on, make me cry. We have a civilian requiring assistance north of
the fuck is this shit? Is that yours? Of course not. I have only got myself to blame for the mess these kids are in. You are either drunk, or you're staring miserably at the clouds, or you're out there doing God only knows what. Oh, yeah. I've done horrible by you. Pulled you out of a Midwestern trailer park, got you a big mansion in Rockford Hills. Hell, the only thing you got to worry about anymore is what part of your body you want to have chopped off or sucked out again. Screw you, Michael. Ah, but you won't. I was faithful to you up until I found you in a stripper. <laughs> I would divorce your ass if I could. You are nothing but a murdering, cheating hypocrite. Thank you, Michael, whatever the fuck our fake last name is. You have ruined my serenity yet again. My yoga is fucked. Oh, is that what they're calling it now? You and your fucking yoga. Did someone say yoga? Oh, hello, Fabian, darling. Namaste. Namaste. You must be Mikhail. Namaste. Hmm. Nah, Michael, fuck yourself. Michael! You've got to work on your anger, brother. It's killing you. Yeah, tell me about it. Ah, there you are, you little shit. Are you looking for this? Ah, 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 ah. No. Very funny. You know, you're a real asshole. What did you just fucking say to me? Stop it! You two, you're ruining my fucking yoga! Somebody say yoga? <gasps> Trevor? Michael. Hey. <laughs> it's good to see you, man. Mm, yeah, I bet it is. Of course, I'm not the one that's been resurrected. Ain't this Graham? Hmm? Yeah, well, I got in a bit of an awkward situation. Mm, you're telling me, bro. Yeah. One of those fake your own deaths to your best buddy, and then run off with the dough, and then live in a big mansion. Awkward situations. <laughs> It's one way of looking at it. Yeah, do you have any other ways of looking at it? Because I am all out. But it was a long time ago, man. I've been in witness protection. I still am. Oh, that's great. That's great. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Where are my manners, right? <laughs> Amanda, it is good to see you. Oh, I missed you. You used to be fatter. Nice new tits, by the way. Jimmy, you, you used to be thinner. But, yeah, I can't blame you. Who are you? Namaste. I'm Fabian. <sighs> Good Lord. Where's Tracy? Where's your sister, Jim? Um, sh she's, a, uh, she's, a. Uh, she's trying out for TV. She's what? Yeah, she's auditioning for fame or shame. Fame or shame? The fuck are you talking about? You know, it's that talent slash skills show. She loves it, you guys know that. What's her talent? Dancing. Oh, Christ, she's a horrible dancer. Michael! Come. She might disagree with you on that. Jesus Christ, what, now? Now? Where? Um, the Mays Bank Arena. Oh, little Tracy being humiliated. Let's go, we go get her. We? Yeah, we, what, are you gonna stand here and argue while your daughter becomes a national laughing stock? Huh? You're worse than I thought. Now let's go, come on! <laughs> 